map when you deal with tragedies like this. So uh, you try to do everything you can to create opportunities for comfort uh, for the kids. A high school is mourning the loss of one of its students. He died after a semi truck driver from Texas hit his car in McLean County this week. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm McLeod Hageman. 17 year old Colin Bain of Gibson City died Wednesday night. WCI 3 Scarlett O'Hara spoke with the school superintendent and Scarlett, how are they coping? Superintendent Jeremy Darnell says he's proud of his school community for supporting each other right now, but that community is small and they're all grieving. Uh, he was high energy, he was high smile, he was high intensity uh, and brought that same image of joy in everything that he did. 17 year old Colin Bain died in a car crash Wednesday night. Now, his soccer teammates, peers, and the staff at Gibson City Melvin Sibley High School are coping with what they say is an unthinkable loss. We just gave them absolute autonomy, and the adults uh, rotated through the building uh, and just gave them space, gave them an opportunity to manage the situation and grieve the way that they felt was best. He says all but eight students showed up the next day because they just wanted to be together. There was an enormous amount of closeness, uh, kids consoling each other. Uh, there were tears, there was laughter, um, there were stories. GCMS posted a photo of Bain on social media, and he says it reached over 67,000 people. And in a town of under 4,000, that shows he was special. And that's because people are drawn to him, and, and his, uh, his memory is going to live like that picture in a very positive way. He says there's no playbook for leading a school through tragedy, and he appreciates the neighboring schools who showed their support this week. They all said we're wearing red and black and supported GCMS, and that means a lot. Because at the end of the day, when you're an educator, you're in it for serving kids. And uh, when something bad happens to your kids, you all feel it. Even though Bain was a junior, Superintendent Darnell says the seniors are planning a quiet way to recognize him at their graduation ceremony tomorrow. Mac. All right, Scarlett, thank you.